Hi, I'm Mike Stone. I'm an emergency physician and a point of care ultrasound specialist, and I'm going to show you how to identify the important landmarks anatomically and based on ultrasound for performing an ultrasound guided erector spinae plane block or ESP block using the IQ. The ESP block is a relatively new block in regional anesthesia. It provides a large territory of sensory block to the chest wall, and in the emergency department, we're using it predominantly for control of pain in patients with multiple rib fractures. In this case, we're positioned prone. The block can be performed with the patient sitting upright or in a lateral decubitus. You're going to identify the approximate T5 level between the scapula. Use a musculoskeletal preset because we're not really looking for individual nerves in this case. We're really looking for bones and muscles. And we're going to put the IQ on with the indicator towards the patient's head in a parasagittal plane just over the middle of the scapula, interscapular region just to the... Uh, to the midline of the scapula. When we put the transducer on, we're going to see rib and shadow and pleura, just like we do for a pneumothorax exam. From here, we'll slide the transducer medially following the ribs until the ribs turn into the transverse process. And at this level, we're able to look at the transverse process there in the middle of the screen, just deep to the erector spinae muscle, and the transducer will be held in this orientation with the non-dominant hand, and with the dominant hand, a needle will be inserted from the cephalad aspect of the probe in plane. It'll come down, in this case, from the left of the screen, land gently onto the transverse process, and inject a large volume, 20 to 30 mLs of anesthetic solution, to dissect the erector spinae muscle off of the transverse process. And this will spread throughout the ESP, the erector spinae plane, and will provide a large territory of sensory analgesia for the patient with multiple rib fractures. So that's the procedure for identifying the relevant anatomy and injection site for an ESP block using the IQ.